I love you. Oh. I have my humidifier going full blast now. Trying to give myself some life. Oh, look how pretty the sunrise looks. Okay, good morning. I'm finally up, did my makeup, got dressed. Uh, I love my hair when I braid it, when it's dry and then sleep on it. it. Just makes the perfect little waves. And it's about 10 a.m. now. Me and my brother are just going to meet my parents for breakfast. I think we're going to Denny's, which I love Denny's. I love going out for breakfast food. It's like my favorite, it's just so good. And then right after breakfast, they're gonna be leaving. So, yeah, that's kind of the plan. And then I'll just have the rest of the day to, I don't really know what I'm doing today yet. Just kind of getting my stuff together, preparing for the holidays, stuff like that. But yeah, I am really excited to just not work and just catch up on everything, clean up everything, get everything ready for the holidays. And yeah, I'm feeling really good today happy ready to go so let's go We're back in Cabela's. Yeah. I've been here like 10 times in the past two weeks, I feel like. I just can't leave. It's just my favorite place, apparently. Okay, so there's teriyaki. There's teriyaki it's really weird. There's something Kimberly. about this place that just feels kind of homey. Even though I'm not really a hunter or a farmer. Well, obviously my family is hunters and farmers, but I don't really do that. So I don't know why this feels so homey. It's really weird, but we're getting stuff to make sausages. 
Kayla, do you see any kind of sweet pepper, jerky, spice? Okay, so a couple of them. Mild Italian. We just finished at Cabela's and it's raining in December. This is just craziness. My hair is all aloof. So my mom just left and now I'm here all by my lonesome. Um, it's so weird. I feel like I'm not the only one that like feels this, but like I hate the feeling when you've like been spending time with people for like a long time. Like when like my mom comes to visit or whatever and then they leave because like right after they leave, you just sit there and you're like, hmm. Like, I have no idea what to do, and I just feel, like, kind of, like, lonely and sad. It's so weird. Like, once they're gone for a while, and I'm, like, used to, like, being by myself and stuff, then I just am perfectly fine being alone all the time. But, like, it's those first moments, once they're gone, that I'm just, like, okay, what do I do now? Um, And it's just, like, when I hang out with my friends, too. I mean when I used to hang out with my friends because I haven't seen any of them for more than five minutes since the start of October. So basically two months now, which is crazy. But yeah, whenever I used to hang out with my friends for like a while and then I go home and not see them, I'd feel so like, I don't even know what the feeling is. It's like sad, but like restless, but like, I don't know. It's a really crappy feeling and I feel it like every single time I'm like with people and then I'm not. Um, but yeah, I don't know if anyone else can relate to that, but that is how I feel right now. So <laughs> I don't really know what to do. So I'm probably going to go lay on my couch and watch YouTube or Netflix. Just have a nice chill Saturday. I don't really have anything like else to do that I need to really get done. Uh, I do want to go to the dollar store, probably the dollar store, and get my friend a gift bag for a gift. And then I, I don't know if I should get one other little thing or not. Like, it's probably good enough, but I do want to get a card too. I guess I can get that at the dollar store though. So yeah, I'm probably going to go to the dollar store to get my friend a bag and a card. And then maybe I'll stop at Winners to see if there's anything other little thing that I can get her. Just because I feel like I should add like one more thing to her gift. And then all I really have to do today is clean up my house. I don't know what it is. Whenever like my mom's in town, my house becomes like a disaster. I guess it's just because I'm kind of occupied and not cleaning up. And no one else in my house really does much cleaning up after themselves. But yes, yeah, so my house is a freaking mess. I need to clean it all up. That won't take too long though. So yeah, first of all, I'm just going to lay on the couch and watch some Netflix or YouTube or something and relax. Maybe edit a video while I do that. And then later I want to run out, finish up Taylor's gift. And then that's kind of all I have to do today. Just a super chill Saturday. And yeah, I'm feeling kind of crappy just because of that feeling I was describing just now. So I'm probably just going to go watch some TV to distract myself. And then we'll see where the day takes us. So yeah, let's go watch some Netflix and just relax for a little bit. And also, I don't have to really do anything today because also tomorrow's Sunday, so I could do whatever I don't get done today.
tomorrow because I also don't work tomorrow. And I'll just be like here all by myself all day. So yeah, that's the plan. Happy Saturday, y'all. I hope everyone's having a really great weekend or day whenever you're watching this. And stay safe, y'all, because it's pretty crazy out there. Pretty crazy out there. I'm just sitting here drinking some Diet Coke and I'm thinking I literally hate how everything costs money like the minute I walk out of my house I'm either going to work and making money barely or spending money like I want to go out of my house and do something because it's Saturday and you know I don't work and I have time to do stuff but literally all that I can do is go spend money you know what I'm saying I'm probably going to anyway because I got paid yesterday <laughs> And I don't know how to save money. So. That's the that on that. I'm going to watch some YouTube. Catch up on my subscriptions. That's the plan, man. See ya. I'm just having some leftover wings. Oh, hello, you want some? I don't think so. For lunch. And, well, like a late lunch, it's like 3 p.m., but we went for breakfast at like 11. And some vegetables on the side with ranch, of course. Got my water. Okay, I decided that I'm going to do my like errands and stuff tomorrow because my mom said she wants me to go to Costco and I do not want to go to Costco today. Going to Costco is like a whole thing, you know? So I'm going to do that tomorrow. So I might as well do all my running around and errands tomorrow. So for the rest of the day, instead of going anywhere, I'm just going to, um, Clean up my house and I decided I'm gonna make some peanut butter cookies because I have this whole thing of peanut butter and I just don't eat peanut butter right now. I don't know. I go through phases with peanut butter, like sometimes I love it and sometimes I do not want to eat it at all. So I decided to make some peanut butter cookies. And that's my plan. Okay, I just woke up from my nap to a little doorbell ring. Well I was like kind of awake, so. I was just kind of laying there and then the doorbell went off and I was like, who is it? A package? But it was Tessa and Erica and they, sorry, my hair looks horrible. <laughs> I took the scrunchie out and now I look like really weird. Um, well, it's a truck outside. Oh my gosh, I'm going through a lot. But they dropped off my Christmas present. Well, when they came before, Erica gave me a cup for my present. And then Tessa gave me a present from her, and it's these sunglasses. Oh my gosh, we were like looking at these, and I'm gonna try to put them on with one hand. We were looking at them like a long time ago, and I was like sure that they sold out, and I was like never gonna get them, because we never went to get them, because I had to leave town, and then we kind of forgot, and it was just like this big thing. But I am so happy, because she went back and got them. I'm literally dying. I was positive that I would never see these again in my life. Let's put them on. Oh my gosh, it's really hard with one hand. Oh my gosh. 
Who is she? A flower, uh, this isn't a flower. A butterfly gal. I literally love them so much. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Okay, these are amazing. Like, are you kidding me? They're a butterfly. I love butterflies. Um, these are seriously freaking amazing. Like, uh, first of all, they're a freaking butterfly. How cute. I love them so freaking much. I can't wait until I can like, you know, go in public and go to a festival and wear these. Uh, I'm so happy. Thank you so much, Tessa. I love you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. What a nice, pleasant little surprise. Ugh, so nice. Of course, listening to Taylor's Evermore album, it's just so good, I can't stop listening to it. I know it's like so hyped, but like for a good reason, okay? So I am just jamming to that, and now I'm really about to expose myself because <laughs> this house is scary, but that needs to be vacuumed, but that probably just ain't gonna happen right now. This is the state of the living room. Um, there's not really much to mess up, but what could be messed up is definitely messed up. We got a new lamp in that corner finally because there's no lights in this living room. There's no lights in like any living room that you rent, but it's really annoying. So we finally got a lamp for that corner. It's obviously not that cute or anything, but it was super cheap and we just needed one, so we got it. Uh, don't mind the exercise machines back there. There's literally nowhere else to put them in this place. So that's just kind of where they go for when I feel like breaking out the home workout in here. But now you're about to be really scared. So yeah, that is the state. The island always ends up being a place where you just throw everything, especially when you're just like coming and going and stuff. So it's an absolute disaster. Also, <laughs> I decided to put my snowboard in here. I mean, it's obviously not ideal at all, but this is kind of just where all the stuff goes. <laughs> Nobody even looks over here anyway. And it's obviously better than right in front of the front door where it was all week. But I need to clean up all of this stuff. So let's get to it. My friend Taylor just dropped off a Christmas present for me. Wow. <laughs> All my friends are just coming by. It's like Christmas today. Should I open it? Okay, I will. I told all of my friends not to get me anything. 
and all of them got me something. Good thing I actually got them things too. But I'm just very last minute and slow at getting things, so they might get them after Christmas, but that's okay. Oh my gosh, what is it? I wonder what it is. Oh my gosh, I think I know what it is actually. I knew it! dying i love my friends this is hilarious oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh i'm gonna cherish these for the rest of my life they're like friends wine glasses i'm dying i'm literally dying oh my gosh wait this one's turned these are so cute. Thank you so much, Taylor. I don't think you watch my videos, but I love you. I love these. I knew that these, as soon as I saw it or felt them, I knew they were these because I forget if it was Taylor or Jared, but they sent a picture of these. And I was like, I need those. I need those now. And she got them. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna drink a glass of wine tonight just to celebrate these beautiful new wine glasses. I love them. This makes me so happy. I love them. And some freaking chocolates. I actually want one of these right now. I'm like really in the chocolatey mood. Wow, I haven't had classic Lindor's in so long. Oh, they smell so good. Oh my God. That is so cute. Should I give her her present in the exact same bag? Because I needed to get a bag for her. <laughs> yeah, that'd be kind of weird. But, wow. I'm so happy. Here's a closer look. If those aren't the cutest things you've ever saw in your life, I love them. And also, I love that they don't have a stem. Stemless wine glasses are my favorite. Wow, so cute. I'm so happy. I love my friends. I love my friends so much. I miss my friends. I'm so sad because I miss my friends so much. Close enough, right? Okay, I finished cleaning up everything. It feels so much better. I like cannot function in a messy space. I just, ugh, it feels so much better once it's all clean. Well, I can't function very well in a messy space. Let's put it that way. <laughs> Cause I have some messy spaces, let's just say. So I finished cleaning everything up, drinking some H2O. I have not drank enough water today at all. And I just feel so much better now. Everything's clean, except for the junk corner behind me, but that's okay. I was going to have a celebratory glass of wine in my new beautiful wine glasses that I love so freaking much, but honestly, I haven't drank since like October 3rd, I think. So it's like basically two months and I just like don't really want to drink because I'm here like completely by myself and even just a casual glass of wine is just better with a friend to sit and talk to and even if I have like literally one drink I know it'll like make me miss my friends and like want to drink with my friends and I literally can't because of the restrictions so like even with just like a couple of us so I just don't even want to like have a drink and like make myself want to drink with my friends or miss my friends because it'll just suck like I get I hate that feeling when like I really want to see my friends but I can't and like in normal times I love having just a casual glass of wine by myself at night but with these COVID times and like 
the restrictions so so strict right now and me literally not being able to see them even if I wanted to I just like don't even want to do that to myself <laughs> honestly so I'm just not gonna have a glass of wine maybe I'll drink some water in my new glasses <laughs> but yeah I kind of want a glass of wine but I just like don't even want to drink because it's been so long and I know it'll just like make me miss my friends because drinking is fun with friends and less fun by yourself, especially in these depressing times. So now I am going to eat some leftover Chinese food for supper and then I'm going to make peanut butter cookies. And I was going to uh, put sprinkles on them, like red and green, to like make them Christmassy. But I remembered I actually hate sprinkles. I know it's kind of weird, like people love sprinkles. I hate them. It's like eating sand. It's like you have this delicious soft cookie and then you got like grainy bits of sand in your mouth. Like I hate sprinkles, it's so weird. I'll eat them but I really, really try not to because I don't like sprinkles at all. I just think they're really stupid and disgusting. But anyways, yeah, I'm gonna try to make peanut butter cookies. They're probably not gonna work that well because uh, I have like all natural peanut butter and it might be crunchy peanut butter and it has like chia seeds in it. I think I showed it on the vlog sometime, but yeah, it's kind of weird peanut butter and maybe that's why I haven't been eating it. <laughs> And it also has coconut oil in it. It's really weird peanut butter. So it probably isn't gonna like work that good because everything calls for like smooth, you know, like the classic, like really, really processed smooth peanut butter. But we'll see how it goes. We're gonna try. Anyway, even though everything I cook and bake fails, I'm still gonna keep trying. <laughs> um, and yeah, it's just super chill. Day at home, it was really nice to see Tessa and Erica and then Taylor today. But honestly, I like hate seeing my friends when it's just like brief and I can't even like have them over and actually see them. Cause it just makes me so sad and makes me miss them. But I'll see them again one day, maybe. So yeah, I'm gonna do all my running around tomorrow. I need to get a couple more things for Taylor and a bag for her. And then I'm still waiting for Tessa and Erica's presents to come. Well, like parts of them. So they're definitely getting those after Christmas. And yeah, I need to go do Taylor's present tomorrow and then Costco. Also, Taylor's present's more of a rush because she's moving, which is so sad. <sighs> she literally lives like two streets down from me right now. I literally can't imagine like her not being my neighbor. But like with COVID, I literally haven't seen her for two months anyway. It's so horrible, it's so horrible. Anyways, I'm gonna get Taylor's present, go to Costco, get a few things for my mom, hopefully nothing else, but Costco always really gets me. That's why I literally don't go unless I have to or really need to, or really want to. That's that. Let's eat some dinner and then make some cookies. I'm excited. I really hope they turn out. I don't have much faith in myself, to be honest, but I'm really, really, really gonna try. How is this eight minutes? This is this an eight minute clip? What have I, what did I just talk about? I literally don't remember anything that I said. I think I blacked out. Eight minutes. Nine minutes now. Okay, goodbye. Let's go eat some food and make some cookies. Okay? Okay. I've got the leftover Chinese food here. So, so yummy. I'm so excited to eat this. It was super good. We tried a new place and it was actually delicious. I think it was like J&A something or TNA. I actually don't remember, but it was so, so good. And the service was amazing. The guy was so nice and so cute. And he gave us four free pops. It was so adorable. So this is my dinner. This is my dinner. It looks so, so, so good. We threw out the red sauce for the chicken balls and shrimp. 
I didn't realize there was so many left or else I would have kept the sauce, but that's okay. Still delicious. Okay, so as I was getting all of my ingredients ready for these cookies and looking at the recipe, I realized that if I actually include in the vlog, it's going to be way too long for this video. So I decided I'm just going to make a separate video of me making these cookies. Yeah, because I said I wanted to do more baking videos on my channel and I'm behind on the video. <laughs> so I might as well. Just so that this video isn't like so long and just so that I can actually kind of take advantage of making these cookies also instead of just like including like one clip. So I'm making the cookies right now and I'll let you know what I get up to after that. And if you want to see me make the cookies and see what they actually turn out like because I don't think it's going to be that great. <laughs> It'll be in the next vlogmas video. So let's go make these cookies and I'm going to try my best and follow the recipe really closely. And I hope they work out. <laughs> I'm watching Dawson's Creek while I bake my cookies. It's really dramatic. And really interesting acting. <laughs> I like love this show and hate it at the same time. Not anymore, it's not. It's interesting. Just wait. I brought all the presents that we got from my mom downstairs. And, oh my gosh, I'm not gonna lie to you. I bowled out this year. <laughs> Me and my brother go together on all of our presents, so they're like all from both of us, but yeah, it's a lot. <laughs> I'm gonna try and reorganize this tub so that everything fits in here better because right now it looks crazy and it's kind of hard to move. So I'm gonna try and do a little reorganizing of this tub right now while I wait for my cookies to bake. That's a little bit better. At least I'll be able to carry it now. Also, yes, we got her a Furbo. I am so excited for when she opens this and I can use it. <laughs> oh, I hope she likes it. It's kind of like something that she might think is like really stupid or else she'll like love it. But she is like literally obsessed with Georgia. So I think she'd love to be able to like watch her on the camera when she's not home, especially when she's working like 12 hour shifts. I think she'll love it. I really hope so anyway. And yeah, there's everything there. Oh my gosh, my timer. They're ready. They're ready. Okay, I finished making the cookies. They actually turned out good. That will be the next video that I upload after this one. And it's now literally 8.47. I am shocked. I thought it was like five. I guess I woke up from my nap at 5, so it, that would not make any sense. But, like, I can't believe it's 9 p.m. I literally thought it was, like, so much earlier. This day has just flown by. So, yeah, I was kind of getting motivated to, like, go drive around a little bit and just look for some Christmas lights. But I guess I'll do that tomorrow night, maybe. Just to kind of add some Christmas content to this, because it really hasn't been, like, that Christmassy of a vlogmas. It's kind of just normal, <laughs> but that's kind of how it is. When I'm at my house instead of like at home where I can like do stuff with my family and like we have like the tree there and I can wrap presents there and everything like that. So once I go home, it will be more Christmassy because I can wrap presents and like do some baking with my mom and stuff like that. But for now, this is just kind of what it is. So yeah what am i gonna do now oh my gosh i guess i'll just sit down and edit a video because i still need to edit a video for today and it's 9 p.m like where did this day go i literally was planning on editing so much today and i didn't edit at all <sighs> i'm a flop i'm a big flop but let's go edit because might as well start now now is better than never right I think so. Okay, y'all. It is just that time of the night where I need to go 
take off my makeup and get ready to go to bed because I'm so tired. <sighs> like I said, my energy is just like so low these days. I don't know what it is. Also, I had eyeliner on today and <laughs> I've just been rubbing my eyes so much from like I don't know like how tired I am that like <laughs> it's completely rubbed off <laughs> so that's great but um yeah I am so ready to take my makeup off and go to bed honestly I was trying to finish editing a video to upload tonight but honestly it's so late I just don't even think there's a point of uploading a video tonight so tomorrow I'm going to try and upload a few videos and get a little bit more caught up yeah tomorrow's gonna be a busy full day and I'm really excited for it honestly to just like get some stuff done and get caught up and stop feeling like I'm just like constantly behind <laughs> with my vlogmas um but yeah so tonight I'm gonna try to get all of my footage that I filmed onto my computer and all sorted in the specific days and then tomorrow I'm gonna wake up and edit 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 and then do some shopping and running around and yeah tomorrow's gonna be a really good day and I'm excited to edit some videos and get them up but tonight is time to go lay in my bed and get some sleep because I'm just exhausted. I don't know what it is. Life is just like taking a lot out of me these days, I feel like. But tomorrow's Sunday and it's going to be a really great day. So thank you so much for watching. Everyone, take care of yourselves. Go take a bath. Tell your mom you love her. Call your friends. And be kind to strangers. I'll see you in the next Vlogmas video.